I think he's ready to fight Martinez. Do I guarantee that he'll beat Martinez? No. But the thing I love about this fight is after going through, you know, on the Mayweather fights, on the Pacquiao fight, every fight is eight to one, nine to one. This fight is eight to five. The opening line in Vegas was eight to five. Martinez. Now that reflects a very even fight. Bob was mentioning a table full of a few of you guys uh, that you know once top ranked Bob Fernando and Julio's team believed that that Julio Jr. was ready for this fight, it took all of a half hour to make this deal. And making deals in boxing shouldn't be rocket science. You know, it's not that hard to do. You know, if you decide to do what's best for the sport to deliver the fans what they deserve. Um, this isn't rocket science. Too often our business is characterized by bad decisions from judges, but also bad decisions from business people that cause us not to put our best foot forward. To forget that video that started out this, this little press conference that said this is boxing because this is a sport of kings, the sport of Muhammad Ali and Joe Frazier, the sport of Hearns, Leonard, Duran, and Hagler, and the sport of Sergio Martinez, Julio Cesar Chavez, and Julio Cesar Chavez Jr. And um, this is about as good as it gets. This is the best fight you can make in the middleweight division, period. It's such a pleasure to have him with us today. He's the father of the champion. He is celebrating today his 50th birthday. Please welcome the one, the only, the Hall of Famer, Julio Cesar Chavez. Gracias, Bob. Thank you, Bob. Bueno, primeramente, dar las gracias a todos los que, a todos los que, a todos los presentes. First of all, I would like to thank all of you for being here. A todos los medios de comunicación para esta gran pelea. Pues, eh, como lo he venido diciendo, no, definitivamente. Like I, I have been saying, definitely. Creo que esta es la pelea. Que todos querían. This is the fight that everybody wanted. Eh, definitivamente sabemos que, que Julio va a una pelea difícil, a una pelea dura. I know that Julio is going to a difficult fight, a tough fight. Sabemos que Martínez está considerado como uno de los mejores peleadores de la actualidad. We know that Martínez is considered a one of the best fighters uh, now. A mí en lo personal no me gusta, se me hace un peleador apestoso, un peleador, un peleador correlón, un peleador eh, eh, que te baja las manos bueno, pero en fin a él, le, a él le, 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 le ha servido and personally I don't like his style he's a runner, he, he stings he, he only he put his hands down but well, it works for, it works for him y en lo particular eh, creo que Con todo respeto de todos ustedes, ha hablado mucho buche, mucha mierda. And, in, and personally, with all the respect for all of you, he has been talking only bullshit, only trash. Pero el 15 de septiembre, toda esa mierda que ha hablado se la va a tener que tragar. Gracias. But on the 15, all the bullshit he has, he has been talking, he needs, he's going to need to eat it. Bueno, estamos muy contentos de que ya por fin esté confirmada esta pelea We're very happy that finally we confirmed this uh, fight que por fin este Bocasa de Junior le va a entregar el cinturón al verdadero campeón que es Sergio that this uh, big mouth of Junior finally we plan to bring back the title that belong to Martinez y que se cuide mucho Junior and be sure that you need to watch out yourself. Que la verdad, no sé que, no sé de qué forma irá a pelear contra al mejor libra por libra. I don't know how we plan to fight the best pound pound fighter. Tiene un problema muy grande. He has a major problem. Al enfrentarse con Sergio. To confront Sergio. Sergio, el 15 de septiembre le va a callar la boca y te van a entregar el cinturón al verdadero campeón. Muchas gracias.
on September 15, he will shut off his mouth and he will bring back the title to the right chance. Thank you. Wow. A couple of years ago, we first started barking and yelling and doing all the stuff that got Senor Chavez so upset. Um, honestly, back then, we didn't think it was much of a fight. You know, uh, I wasn't worried about it. I, I saw a tall, skinny kid, didn't look much like his father, looked a little awkward in there. I didn't think he could go, he could go three or four rounds with Madavia. Um, my own camp knows this, most of you in the press know this. I tend to get nervous before fights. I'm one of those guys that just get nervous. I get emotionally involved, I get nervous. I'm nervous. I'm not going to bullshit you, I'm nervous. I'm nervous because this is a real fight. I'm nervous because of the bigger, stronger guy sitting right here. I'm nervous because when they walk in the ring that night, he's going to weigh about 165 pounds and he's going to weigh about 180 pounds. And when a guy like mine does this, you get hit by a guy weighing 180 pounds, it's a little scary. But I know what kind of champion is sitting to my left. And a couple of seconds ago, I, we were honored to listen to one of the greatest fighters of all time. And on the left is one of the greatest fighters of our time. And on September 15th, we're going to see why Sergio Martinez is one of the greatest fighters of our time. The best middleweight on the planet, Sergio Maravilla Martinez. Hello, hello everyone. Uh, welcome. Uh, okay, uh, now I speak Spanish, okay? Translate Samson. Bad, bad translate, okay? Uh, Samson, the. Uh, bueno, primero quiero dar las gracias eh, a, a la Top Rank y a Chávez Jr. por haberme dado esta, este combate. I want to say thank you to Top Rank and Jr. to accept this uh, fight. Por fin, por haberme dado este combate y dejar de escapar como gallina macho. Finally, he said yes and not run like a chicken. Era hora que las gallinas salgan de gallinero, ¿no? It's time for the chicken to go out of this place. Yo sé que todos lo piensan, pero yo me animo a decirlo. Everybody thinks, but I have the, the, the way to say it. Bueno, el 15 de septiembre le voy a pegar hasta en el carnet de identidad y le voy a dar la paliza de su vida a Charlie Jr. Okay. I want to really fight, I will, pay, I, I will beat up his ID card and, and really beat him up. No, no le va a ayudar ni siquiera al bate de Bitbull con el que entrena. Uh, nobody will help him, including who is training for him. Ok, esperen de mí la mejor producción, la mejor pelea el 15 de septiembre próximo. Wait for me for the best fight that I ever did. I would like just to confirm that and tell him that eres un cabrón payaso. Oh, yeah. A mí me la pela. <laughs> He's not the only club. We have two. Tenemos dos payasos. Y bueno, antes de antes de seguir, before I continue, I would like to tell you something. The clown's gonna have the last lap. I would like to tell you that uh, Julio Cesar Chavez has has been made a name by his own. He is a fighter that uh, has scaled a lot in his career. I think he's uh, he's becoming one of the best fighters in the world, and he's got the opportunity to prove it on September 15. Finally, with this clown, he's gonna he's going to to prove that he's the best the best middleweight in the world, and uh, I, it's a real pleasure, a real real pleasure to introduce the son of the legend and the legend himself, Julio Cesar Chavez Carrasco. Hola. Primero que nada, gracias a todos por venir. Well, first of all, uh, thank you everybody for being here. Estoy muy emocionado y muy contento por esta gran oportunidad, esta gran pelea. I'm very excited, very happy for this great opportunity, for this great fight. Eh, gracias a todo el equipo de Sergio también por darme la oportunidad. Also, I would like to thank uh, the team Martinez for giving me this opportunity. Creo que esta es una gran pelea, una pelea que toda la gente estaba pidiendo. Well, I think this is a great fight. This is a fight that everybody has been asking for. Esta es la pelea que yo quiero porque quiero demostrarle a Sergio y quiero demostrarle al mundo que soy el mejor campeón de peso medio del mundo. This is the fight that I want because I want to prove to Martinez and I want to prove to all the world that I'm the best middleweight in the world. Mm, yo creo que <laughs> Martinez 
ha estado entrenando, eh, ha estado bailando para, para entrenar para la pelea porque es de la única forma así que, que puede ganarme. Well, I think that Martinez has been dancing and that's the type of training that he's gonna make, he's gonna do for the fight because that's the only way that he can beat me, dancing. Creo que ya encontró su, su verdadera profesión como bailarín. I think that uh, he found his real profession as a bailarina. No creo. You got is good enough for me. Bueno, eh, la verdad que siempre he sido una buena persona y me da gusto que haya encontrado su verdadera profesión porque después del 15 de septiembre tiene que ver bien qué es lo que va a hacer porque el día 15 de septiembre le voy a demostrar arriba del ring quién es el mejor campeón de peso medio del mundo. I have been always a good person and uh, I wish him the best and uh, I'm very happy that he found his real profession as a bailarina because uh, after the 15 uh, he's gonna need to, to find something to do. Gracias a todos por venir y el día 15 de, de, de septiembre les prometo una gran pelea y voy a ganar. Gracias a todos. Thank you everybody for coming and on Gracias. September 15 I promise you I will beat Martinez and I will promise you uh, uh, you will have a great fight. Llévate una foto Junior el 15 de septiembre. No te olvides la foto. Si no te van a reconocer nadie. ¿verdad? Don't forget to take another picture because no, nobody will recognize you. Like like September 15. Be sure that you take pictures. Push, push. Padre también puedes subir el rincón para que ya no esté ahí. Maybe the father will come to the corner like this. He's start to 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 father, you know. To defend so much his son, maybe we should go together. You always you 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 instead to watch the fight, you go to the corner, you go back, you you like like you are the trainer, but you're nothing. I'm quiet, please. <laughs> <laughs> Porque ustedes saben que una pierna es más.